What's going on my ASVAB party people? I'm Anderson, your ASVAB coach. And before we begin the video here, before we start this problem, which is a pretty good one, I want you to know that we're actually doing a free ASVAB class today. So if you wanna join, it starts at 6 p.m. Eastern time. You can join with that link right there and you get a free practice test included with video solutions. So I think it's pretty useful. Come join us if you wanna learn more about this. So let's go ahead and get to this problem here. Now we can crush this and feel a little more confident. So first things first, I don't care what kind of problem we're dealing with. Obviously, this is an age word problem. I don't care. The first thing you always need to do is start with the question. I got your back here. So step one, start with the question, what is it that we want? So it says, if Henry is 16, how old is John? Right there. That's the goal. The goal, you need to be very, very, very good at pointing out the goal. How old is John? That's all I want. I want John's age. That's the goal. John's age equals blank. That's all I care about. That is all I care about. Now, the next step, once you can identify what the goal is, again, in terms of the story, in English, no math yet, now we're going to go ahead and now look at the information and see everything and anything that relates to John's age. That's the goal here. So here, boom, step two. What information do we have that's connected to John? That's all I care about. So I see here that it says John is five years older than Mary. So what I'm going to write for that is this. John right there is. Now, what does the word is mean in math? Equals. So John is, John equals five years older than Mary. So when we think about the word older or younger, if we had to translate that to math, and this is a really important skill, if we had to translate that to math, well, that means that older means more, plus. So John is five years plus Mary's age. All right, cool. So that's what I'm gonna write. I'm gonna highlight Mary in purple and say five years older than her. So I'll say John equals Mary plus five. And that's all I'll say right there. Before we continue, just wanna take a quick moment to thank you for watching this video. And all I ask is that you please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. That way more people just like you can see these videos. But on top of that, if you're looking for more ways to practice the right way and raise your score with guidance without stressing, then I really wholly 100% recommend my ASVAB All Access program. The program, long story short, helps you watch, practice, and master every topic from the word knowledge to paragraph comprehension, arithmetic reasoning, math knowledge, general science. It's there and it's designed to help you succeed with practicing the right way. So with that said, check out the link in the description to see how it all works because you're gonna have ways to learn in every way that you prefer. And you get my guidance and my support all the way until you pass. So don't hesitate, stop feeling nervous and being anxious and letting yourself feel that way when there's a solution waiting right here for you. Check out the link in the description, that way you see how it works, and then reach out to me if you have any questions about it. Let's get back to raising our scores. Now, okay, so John is connected to Mary, but do I know Mary's age? No, I gotta keep going, I gotta get more information. Because if I can get Mary, then I can use that to get John. So what information do we know about Mary then? This is kind of like a little scavenger hunt. But here we go. Mary is seven years younger than Ben. Okay. So using that same line of thinking here, Mary right there is equals seven years younger than Ben. Ah, so whatever Ben's age is, we subtract seven to get to Mary. Seven years younger than Ben, Ben minus seven. So let's go ahead and write that down, my party people. So there's Ben, I'm gonna use uh, orange for him. So Ben minus seven. All right, cool. And then, oh my gosh, so do we know Ben? No, but we do know that Ben is twice as old as Henry. So this seems like a lot, right? Let's take a moment to pause here. This seems like a lot, but this is necessary. This is all about first understanding the goal and then building a little roadmap, a little scavenger hunt to get from where you are to that goal. This is the, what it takes. And so we have to be able to do this on a daily basis, on a problem by problem basis to truly build that confidence. I got your back, let's get it done. So we see here that Ben right over here equals twice as old as Henry. So for Henry, I'll go ahead and mark Henry with, uh, let's go ahead and say uh, blue here. 
or I'll just use black to make it easier to see. So twice as old as Henry. Twice means what? Times two. So Ben equals twice Henry. Right there. Jeez. Now, do we have Henry? Yeah, Henry is 16. Okay, cool. Whew. So Henry equals 16. Now, if you're asking, hey, did I need to write all that? Yeah, if you're struggling with word problems, you want to start off by writing things down. Because now that we know that Henry is 16, watch this, my party people. I'm going to plug this in here. And so I'm going to say, hey, look, Ben equals double Henry's age. Two times Henry. Henry is 16. So all I have to do is now plug back in, get Henry, then from Henry to Ben, from Ben to Mary, from Mary to John. Now that's a little bit of a work, but it will work. Here we go. So Ben equals twice Henry, which is double 16, which means that Ben is 32. So Ben right here is 32. So I can replace this right here with 32 because Ben is 32 years old. So that's what I'll do now. I'll plug it back into that equation. So we said that Mary over here, Mary equals 32 minus seven, Ben minus seven, which means that Mary will be 25 years old. But we're not stopping there. We don't want Mary, we want John. This is the big thing right there. That's what we want. So we're gonna go ahead and keep plugging back in. We know that John is Mary plus five. And so this is how we'll finish it off. Let's be real, my Hasbat party people. You're enjoying this YouTube video, but why don't you join me for a free class? I host a free class once a week for two hours. So imagine two hours of free ASVAB math instruction by yours truly, where you get to ask questions, grow with me, raise your score, and get the job you want. So go ahead, click the link here or in the description to sign up for free. And from there, I'll see you in the next class. But until then, let's get back to the math party. We know that John equals Mary, which is 25 years old, Mary, 25, plus five. 25 plus five is 30 years of age, and that is how old John is. John is 30, and that's why the answer is D, and that's why I want you to join our free class tonight at 6 p.m. You can go ahead and join and get a free practice test at the same time with video solutions because we want to see you succeed. And so with that said, my ASVAB party people, go ahead and click the link in the description or go to asvab.info slash class to join for free. With that said, I'll see you later. Let's keep basing the ASVAB, my party people. Let me know if you have any questions. My party people, as always, thanks for watching. Please make sure you're subscribed to the channel. That way you can see all the updates that we come out with so you can keep improving. So don't wait, subscribe now. And then while you wait for the next video, look here or there to see a related video that's gonna help you improve even more. Let's keep raising that score and let's get the job we want. I'll see you soon.